हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द मैथ्स क्लास इन आर चैप्टर क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशंस वी हैव डन क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशंस बाय डिस्क्रिमिनेंट मेथड बाय कंप्लीटिंग द स्क्वेयर मेथड equations reducible to quadratic form sum and product of roots of a equation symmetric functions of roots now today our last topic is word problems in word problems we are going to discuss how to read statement and from that statement how to make a quadratic equation then find the value of missing variable by using discriminant method by completing the square method or by using factorization method so our first example is divide 33 into two parts whose product is 242 first of all we are going to underline the keywords divide number 33 how many parts are there two parts and their product is 242 so let first part is equals to x and second part is 33 minus x now according to the given condition product of these two parts is equals to 242 so x into 33 minus x equals to 242 After applying arrow method, our value is thirty-three x minus x square equals to two forty-two. Now, by collecting this term, x square minus thirty-three x plus forty-two equals to zero. Now, from here, we are going to solve this quadratic equation by factorization method you can solve by any method by discriminant also and by completing the square method also from here value of x equals to 11 and 22 now when x equals to 11 then first part is x so answer is 11 and second part is 33 minus x so 33 minus 11 answer is 20 and when x equals to 22 so first part is equals to 22 and second part is equals to 33 minus x so 33 minus 22 answer is 11 therefore required two parts are 11 and 22 because in both the values answers are same This is the first example related to word problem. Now, example number two. The sum of a number and its reciprocal is forty-one upon twenty. Then find the numbers again. Keywords are sum, a number, reciprocal. Is forty one upon twenty, and we have to find numbers. So let number is equals to x, and reciprocal of a number is one upon x. Now, according to the given condition, sum of both the number is equals to forty one upon twenty. Now, from here, after taking LCM equation is x square plus one upon x 
equals to 41 upon 20. Now, from here, cross multiply. Then after cross multiply, our equation is 20x square plus 20 equals to 41x. Now, after collecting, equation is 20x square minus 41x plus 20 equals to 0. Now, from here, split the second term. So, equation is 20x square minus 16x minus 25x plus 20 equals to 0. From here, 5x minus 4 and 4x minus 5 equals to 0. These are the factors. So, value of x after either and or step, our answer is 4 upon 5 and 5 upon 4. You can solve this by discriminant and by completing the square method also. Therefore, our required numbers are 4 upon 5 and 5 upon 4. This is the second example related to word problems. Now, example number 3. Find the number which exceeds its positive square root by 20. So, again, we have to find number. Let number equals to x. Exceeds means minus and Square root of a number, same number x, square root x is equals to 20. Now, let number equals to x. According to the given condition, x minus square root of x is equals to 20. Now, to solve this, we have to shift square root term to right hand side. This is the easy way to solve this equation. Now, plus 20 shift this side becomes minus 20. Now, equation is x minus 20 equals to under root x. Now, squaring both side. Then, x minus 20 whole square is equals to under root x whole square. Then, apply a minus b whole square. So, a square plus b square minus 2ab equals to square and under root finish and after collecting our equation is x square minus 41x plus 400 equals to 0. Now from here you can solve this equation by using factorization method, by discrimination method or by completing the square method. Now, our example number 4 is the sum of the squares of 3 consecutive natural numbers is 110. We have to find the numbers. So, our keywords are sum of the squares. 3 consecutive natural numbers is 110. So, let 3 natural numbers are x, x plus 1, x plus 2. Now, according to the given condition, sum of the squares. So, x square plus x plus 1 whole square plus x plus 2 whole square is equals to 110. Now, from here, apply a plus b whole square. So, x square plus 1 plus 2x plus x square plus 4 plus 4x equals to 110. Now, after solving this, our equation is 3x square plus 6x minus 105 equals to 0. Now, solve this equation by using any method. After solving, our answers are x equals to 5 and minus 7. But, x equals to minus 7 is rejected because x belongs to natural number or 3 consecutive natural numbers. So, therefore, from here, value of x equals to 5. 
so these are the examples related to word problems now students you are able to do related sums of this topic before starting the worksheet given in snap homework you must go through the links guided in the snap homework and from this topic our chapter quadratic equation is finished now next time we are going to start with our new chapter arithmetic progression that also you have done in 10th standard thank you and have a nice day